seven years ago, I made a decision that I wanted to do strictly abstract expressionism. I wanted to make it up all completely strictly from my hand, to walk up to a, a canvas, or in my case a board, and just express how I feel in an abstract way. Why abstract expressionism? It's this deep intuitive feeling. It's just about everything. It's how I feel at that moment. It's the sky. It's situations I've been in that have created some sort of emotional experience. And reflecting on it in a positive way as much as possible. I start with three different colors that are mixed and I do large gestural movements or mark making on the panel. And from there I add color and it's layer upon layer upon layer. The paintings are about 10 to 15 layers and putting on large marks and taking off marks um, by covering it up, but also leaving evidence of former marks is really important to me. The history aspect of the piece is important to me. I would say that I really just sort of feel the color. I'll put down certain colors that I tend to use and, um, and then I start mixing and it's all about getting it moving and really giving a sense of what I'm feeling at that time. The work completely builds off the previous work. So my work is my reference. It's almost as if I'm forming when I paint a painting, which is very enjoyable for me. My work is sort of who I am, the soul and depths of my personality. And it's as much as a surprise or interesting journey for me as it may be for someone who looks at it. And that's really how I approach it. I start in the beginning of the year with a theme and an idea and with gratitude. Um, I focused on that each day, every day I would wake up and think about how lucky I was just to be alive, really, the simple things. To move forward with that, you know, that I have a wonderful family and an opportunity to pursue my passion. 